Western Front so I know it's been a while since I posted a video but you knew that I was not gonna let Target Miss Sony go by without uh, talking to you guys so I wanted to give you like I'm gonna open up my book all of my tricks so that you guys can figure out how like not to be left out next time so I'm gonna give you some tips and some tricks on when you do find a designer collaboration how to make sure that you get your hands on something the number one tip that I can give you is to be organized like make sure that you have a game plan when you go in the store I actually took um, quite a few items um, copy paste it put it in a spreadsheet like figured out what were gonna be my top items to buy so that when that day did finally come I was able to really be focused and targeted in on what I wanted to achieve so um, maybe that's the manager in me, but that's just kind of the approach that I took in order to make sure that I stayed on track and got all the items that I needed from the collection. Um, if you really want to find out who your friends are, then ask them to go to Target with you for a collaboration or ask them to go to H&M for a collaboration and that's how you'll find out who your true friends are. Um, make sure that you have a friend, like bring one, bring two. If you don't have any friends, then maybe get like a family member or perhaps even someone who you're not that close with but is looking to make an extra buck because I am not above paying someone to stand in line for me or to assist me when I know that like what I want might be on this rack and another thing that I want maybe in this rack. And particularly with Target for Sony, there were houseware items, there was a bicycle, there were women's clothes, there were shoes, and all of those items were in separate departments, like the individual department that's assigned to them. So it's very important that you get together a game plan and figure out like how many bodies do you need to put on it. The third thing that I would say is very important when you're dealing with these collaborations, um, this doesn't come up at H&M obviously, but certainly at Target, is forget about the shopping cart. It's not a game show. This, that's not something that you need. Like Shopping carts are just going to slow you down and it's going to get in the way. I'm a veteran of these Target collaborations, so I'm um, Target McQueen, Target Zach Posen. One thing that you want to do is call your stores in advance because you want to know, A, whether or not that store is carrying those items, B, how much of the stock they anticipate getting. So, and again, I am sharing my top secrets with you guys. So call the stores in advance. Make sure you know that you are going to the right place when the time comes, when the day finally arrive. This particular collaboration was one that was a little bit unique because they did not put any stock out early and usually you can find Target stores where they are just not aware of the importance of not putting the items out until the release date but this time I found that everyone was pretty much on their script and additionally they added one extra thing which was that they wouldn't hold items for you. So that kind of leads into my next thing is you can call the store and ask them to place items on hold. Now certainly you're going to get some associates who are going to answer and just you know tell you no I can't put anything on hold for you but you can also try to be a little bit persistent and you know again money talks via swap so you know maybe offer them something if they are able to put a piece or a garment on hold for you. This is pretty self-explanatory, but don't trust when they say that the uh, website is gonna go up. You wanna like try it a little bit before, like maybe an hour before or maybe 30 minutes before, but you definitely don't want, like it's not get ready, get set, go. You wanna be on that website before the actual time comes. And that's your best shot at getting in and being able to buy anything um, before the site inevitably crashes. Although I, like you were probably, like I was a little bit surprised that the site crashed, but you have to um, have contingency plans. So that's something that you should prepare yourself for. Just make sure that you get on the site a little bit in advance and then refresh, refresh, refresh. Okay, now that I've cued you in on some expert tips on how to navigate a designer collaboration, I wish you guys all luck for Versace for H&M. May the best woman win. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'm, I may be back. I think I'm back. We'll see if I'm back. 
I don't know, um, subscribe button somewhere above here. So if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button so that you can look at future episodes. If you have comments for me, leave them below. I will see you on the next video. Bye.